Hello everyone, this is Randy here again. Another episode of Farm and Simulator 2013. And we are playing on the field map. For uh, Season 2. And yeah, we got our combine going over here. He is still harvesting the barley. And it looks like he needs a little fuel. Either I left him running at some point, or this thing drinks fuel like a fish. It drinks water. Anyway, probably another little uh, short episode. Uh, I had a little bit uh, short episode of one of the farming sim episodes I did, so we'll probably upload these uh, both together. Uh, we'll see once, of course. Uh, as you can see, this tractor does have the plow spec on it as it drops down into the uh, previously plowed area, so that's kind of cool. Let's lower that. And away we go. Actually, I need speed one. As cool as plow spec is, it's kind of annoying at sometimes too, because if you know I drive out of it just a little bit, it kind of bumps up and down, and especially bad if you drive across it, or if you have the uh, like corn planter or even any of the planters that uh, have roll markers. That's considered a plow area, and that you know it's constantly trying to drop down into that. I find that uh, really annoying. Be nice if you know if they could just fix that, that would be uh, nice, but. So yeah, this will probably be an episode of plowing. I don't know if we'll get this uh, entire field done. Probably not. Does uh, obviously take a while to plow. I'm not sure how wide this thing is. It's not very so. Oh, perfect! Came out just about the right spot there. It's like I planned that. If we can uh, get the GPS mod here to work. That's uh, obviously not the correct width. I think that's the width for combine. I mean, I, actually, I don't think I've used a uh, GPS mod with this one yet, so I'm not sure why I would have one. Let's uh, set it to auto. And I'm assuming here I think I need to follow the green line. That looks like the right... Not sure why I would follow the blue one. Now maybe I'm supposed to follow the blue one. Yeah, okay, I think I'm supposed to follow the blue one here, because this is an offset uh, with a plow. That just didn't look uh didn't look right there. Oh that's right, we did uh, use uh GPS mod there. And how come you did not lift up? There we go. He's not uh, dropping in there. It's like he's trying to on the wrong side or something. I'm not sure what's up with that, but. really hard to drive this way, bouncing around like that. Okay, and our combine, uh, he must be stuck. I think he's been sitting at that for a while. I'll do a uh, check on him a minute when we get to the end here. No, you're not stuck. Okay. 
seemed like you were, uh, maybe you were stuck and managed to get unstuck. That looks like what the case was. Probably should have just stayed over there. He's going to be full now, about now two in here. Okay. Bushes there are kind of annoying. And we're going to have to go uh, sell this again, aren't we? Okay. And I should really get rid of that front piece on the combine there, but uh, oh well. That's uh, primarily for canola. I don't think you'd actually use it for a uh, wheat or actually barley in this case. Not 100% sure on that, but I don't think you'd use that uh, particular attachment. Pretty sure that's uh, primarily for barley. Or not, not barley, um, for canola. Come on, tractor, get going. What are we waiting for? Let's take the shortcut across the field again. Get away from that annoyingly slow car. kind of like the uh, idea of one sell point. You know, pretty much just take it to the one and sell it. Don't really have any choices. Don't have to go take the time to look. Make it real easy for setting up course play. Go to the same spot all the time. It's kind of cool too how it uh, revs up the tractor as it uh, raises the box there, the uh, tipper, and it just looks to me like there's uh, something missing a texture there. I wonder if that's where you bring uh, sugar beets and potatoes maybe. It's a possibility. Uh, look out, car coming. Not that that's uh, particularly ever concerned to me in the past, but uh, tend to just uh, you know ride the annoying little bugs over. Merging into traffic here, and you buddy are going slow. What we're gonna do here is we're gonna pass you, and then we're just gonna cut right in front of you. Uh huh. And we think our combine is a bit stucco. Yep, he is stucco. Apparently he must eventually free himself, because... Yeah, there he goes. He backs up. And that's not me. I'm not backing him up there. Yeah, I'm, I just uh, raise the header up and away he goes again. That's a nice animation, how it uh, throws the straw out the back. It's pretty cool. Don't think I ever uh, paid attention to that before. Usually because I drive in cab. And yeah, once we uh, finish up with the Westbridge Hills map, we'll get into this map a little more uh, full bore. 
Probably do uh, some longer episodes. Yeah, right now I'm trying to keep them a little bit shorter than I can. Uh, maybe if I, uh, you know, have extra videos, I can upload two at a time or something. So throw a Westbridge Hills one up and then throw one of these up. Jeez, come on, tractor, make up your mind. You're either up or you're down. Uh, this particular tractor apparently does not have a very good turning radius. Actually, I don't think any of... Well, I shouldn't say any. Most of the tractors from this pack I don't think do, so... Okay, we're going to do this again, huh? Yeah, we'll just leave the GPS mod off then. I can just uh, follow right along inside the track here. That'll get us pretty close to being straight. Ooh, the combine's full again. I should really set up a course play for that. At least for the first part here, though, I'm going to try not to use course play for a little bit. Uh, maybe, maybe we'll use it for a little bit, but not uh, go quite as crazy as we are with uh, Westbridge Hills. But you now smaller fields here, so I don't mind doing the uh, work myself quite as much. It doesn't take you know, well, it'll take maybe 20 minutes to plow this field if we were doing it constantly anyway, not having to go unload that guy all the time. Fuel, 2%. Okay, I think, uh, is he really that low? No kidding, he is, wow. Apparently he guzzles down uh, the fuel. And where do we got a refuel point? Do we have it around? Oh, we do. Excellent. Just unhire them there. And I'm going to have to keep that in mind. Uh, this combine, yeah, apparently drinks fuel like a... Uh, worse than a fish. Hopefully we can uh, fit into that gas station there. Hopefully we get to the gas station before we run out of fuel. That'll be the next problem. Let's see, I think we can take a shortcut through these bushes here. A little bit of a bump there. Oh, and another one there, I guess. And I believe if we go this way... Hopefully we can get him close enough here with his head on. Yeah, there we go. Refuel. Bet you there goes all our money. Let's see, if I leave him, will he keep fueling? Yes, he will. Okay. And then we will keep plowing, and once he's back up to 100%, we'll, uh, or if our money's all gone, we'll uh, go get him out of there and start him back up again. Yeah, good thing uh, fuel in this game I don't think costs as much as it does in real life. Wow, did we uh, miss something here or something? What, uh... Interesting. Hmm. Just curious how we got so much farther out there.
Uh, somebody missed something there. Oh, that's naughty. Oh, somebody missed something there, too. Oh, boy. Yeah, it's probably that last pass or doing her bouncing all over the place. Oh, he's still not fuel, full of fuel yet. Full of fuel. Yay, yay, yay. I'm trying to say that a couple times. Full of fuel. There we go. Okay, there he is. He's full of fuel. We'll get to the end here, and then we'll go uh, get him started back up again. Not sure how we got so far off here. So we used a uh, GPS mod to kind of give us a straight line, too, yet. That's kind of why I uh, did that, but... It's kind of weird. Huh. Oh, well. Yeah, and I'm not too worried if we miss a little bit. We'll come back through the cultivator and clean it up, so. Now, time to get you back out of here without crashing into anything. I don't see any sheep on this map. There's a kind of that like, funny, like, it's like a pallet stand there. That's the only thing I haven't found on this map is the sheep, so I'm not... Maybe there is no sheep? I have no idea. I don't see any icon on the map, let me put it that way. At least that's got, you know, the cows and the chickens. I do not see anything with sheep. Okay, now, buddy, make sure you use the uh, fuel saving mode, huh? Jeez. Okay, that's like uh, half the field done, I guess. And yeah, we'll uh, just call it an episode here, I guess. I'll probably finish this uh, other half off screen, maybe. Uh, we'll see once. So yeah, we'll call it an episode here. If you have any comments or questions, uh, be sure to leave them below. And as always, thanks for watching. Till next time.